What is up guys, back from their video, and I wanted to make an update on the spring snow flower and crab apple tree here. Wow, look at this thing. Uh, I mean, just tons of yellow leaves on this. You can see a lot of leaves are falling to the ground in the rocks, which are gonna get blown out later today. But, wow, only the new growth, and then the leaf just fell. Not even a breeze in the air and a leaf just fell, so a breeze whips through this thing. We're gonna lose lots more of these yellow leaves inside. But you can see it's got a lot of buds set on the tips. They look a little different than most of the actual buds set in the middle. I don't know why it's like that, but at, at the interceptions of each branch as well, we have the nodes. So it looks pretty good. They've got some, some of these are like curled at the top because of all the aphids we had on this tree. But yeah, we get some water today leading into fall. But look at that color on that tree. Kind of, it's early morning, it's about 8.30 in the morning, so it's hard to find a good lighting angle on it. But right here about is pretty nice. You can just see all that yellow color coming out in the spring snowflower and crab apple. This year, instead of the whole tree, it's kind of like the center is changing first. Um, as the bark color does change a little bit for winter too. So yeah, it's pretty nice. So it did put on tons of growth this year, especially down on these few nodes, which I'm gonna leave, I like it a little lower. It's kind of nice a little lower like that. But we're gonna see how some of them branches develop. We want them to start growing upward instead of that one might be growing out too far. So we'll just see how that develops next year. But ooh, this one looks to be like, I don't know what that one's doing. I wanna, I wanna say maybe just like frost damage, but it doesn't look very healthy. So yeah, oh, the leaf just disconnected right off. Yeah, I mean, it's got buds. So we'll see what these plants do next year. Could've got frost damage, a lot of frost. Looks like a lot of those leaves are experiencing similar things. They're just really getting ready for fall. So uh, yeah, anyway, that's the spring snow update. We'll see you guys in the next one.